Hey guys, sitting here with GeekTools.net and welcome to this graphics performance test of the 6970 graphics card from HIS. Um, we are just here in Crisis 2, the newest Crisis out there and it's very gra graphically intensive. And you can see it's performing really well. Uh, on the top right hand corner you can see the frame rates. It's going around 60 frames a second, dropping down to around 56. So once again, I'm just messing around here, I'm not actually trying to play the game, so if you guys want to comment, please comment on the graphics card and not the gameplay. You can see it's performing extremely well, this is stock speeds. Uh, the specs of the system is, well, the 6970 itself, the 2600K, 16GB uh, of memory, and uh, that's really all that matters. Now we are just running off of a normal hard drive, not an SSD. But yeah, you can see it's performing extremely well, especially for the newest and most graphically intensive game out there. It's doing extremely well. And now I do have dual monitors set up, and uh, since it is an ATI graphics card, it does support iFinity, uh, I their surround gaming experience monitor thingy. So uh, I will be showing you that in just a second. I'll just kill myself. Now uh, if you hear that fan going, it's because I actually turn it up to 70% uh, 70, 70 that's why it's so goddamn loud. I have to do that because um, the computer is pushed against a wall and uh, the heat that's exhausted out is uh, continuously gathered be behind the wall, so I had to just push it up a little bit, but that's not too bad. So yeah, there it is. Uh, on one monitor, uh, 1080p by the way, it's not just normal. It's 1080p, hardcore, everything is on high. I did turn VSync off because it will limit me to 30 frames a second, and of course I wanted to show you guys the full frame rates. Um, now I'm going to put the mon oh, well, not the monitor, but the camera back to show you guys the two displays here and I'm gonna enable iFinity and I know you guys can barely see the uh, frames a second up there so I'm gonna go ahead and yell it, out, yell, yell it out to you so here it is dual monitors, dual 1080p monitors going through iFinity and look at that, we still have 46 frames a second dual 1080p monitors you guys 46 frames a second, 50 frames a second, jumping down to 35 frames a second. Uh, that is intense, you guys. That is absolutely amazing. Uh, this is a kick-ass graphics card, you guys. This is absolutely awesome. And remember, I only have one of these guys in there. I'm not doing. I'm not using Crossfire or anything like that. So one graphics card, two monitors playing Crisis is absolutely doable. Uh, we're going up to 50 frames a second here, 40, 40, uh, 39, 40 frames a second when we're looking at the world. But if you're going to tight spaces and stuff like that, it's not going to drop uh, under 30 frames a second. Or 40 frames a second, really. Alright. So, but if you guys are going to be running, you know, if you guys are serious about surround gaming, I definitely recommend SLI or Crossfire. So there it is, you guys. Um, right now we're just stable at 40 frames a second, and uh, better pause it before I get owned. Um, fantastic graphics card, one of the second best, I believe, out there at the moment great performance, uh, stock speeds, not overclocked, and as you can see it performs absolutely amazing. Uh, if you guys have any more questions or comments about this, you can post them below if you have any more games that you would like to see um, done with the 6970 graphics card. You can go ahead and post a comment below. Email me sunny at mastersunny.com, visit my website geektools.net, and uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching and have a great day.